Welcome back everyone. In the last video we cover our left side and in this video we're gonna create right sidebar over here. So let's jump inside Visual Studio Code and let's create a new folder called right side bar and inside that right side bar we will create a new file called right side and let's import it inside the home we can uh, copy this and put it down there over here it's gonna be right right side okay and we can leave this like fixed but it's gonna be right zero let's go to the chrome and this is our right side okay let's add the styling so let's go to our right side and let's add class name it's gonna be flex flex column background white shadow it's gonna be large then border gonna be two over here on that uh, left of Excel, rounded left of Excel. Let's create another div here. Inside that div, now I have class name, flex, flex, column, items, center, and relative with padding top of 10. Great. Inside that, we're gonna have image with a source and alt is gonna be something like nature. Let's close it. Let's edit custom class with age of 48 and rounded that of medium. Let's import that image. Import, it's gonna be water slide slide from our images so fresh images water slide and it's gonna be water slide logipack Let's import it over here. Then slide. Check it out. And it's over here. Let's go back. Check if everything is okay. We got a type over here. It's flex column. And let's check it now. And it's on the middle okay great so what we are gonna put next under this div let's add a paragraph so paragraph let's add a class name to it you wanna be font roboto font normal then text is gonna be small text ray of 700 max width it's gonna be fit no underline tracking it's gonna be normal and leading leading tight padding at the bottom of two and margin left right it's gonna be two as well now I got this text, I'll just copy and paste it, and this is it. Under this p tag, we can create a div inside div, let's add class name with margin left right of 2, margin top of 10. Here we will provide a p tag 
with uh, friends and on that right side we're gonna add friends later but let's just style it for now so let's create font roboto then font medium text is gonna be small text ray of 700 no the line tracking normal leading of none okay under that p tag let's create an input input gonna have the placeholder placeholder search fence and let's add type text we can create that with use state hook and let's create const let's call it input for simplicity set input and it's gonna be use state of empty string we will provide a value over here of that input we can put the name of input and we need on change on change it's gonna have event like function that's gonna be set input to event dot target dot dot uh, name the uh, value so that value and let's add the class name over here it's gonna be border of zero and outline of none and what else we can add let's check it out use state is not defined use state typo and uh, let's check it out and this is our search friend and it's working maybe we can add some i don't know margin top of four and here is our search friend these are now uh, this is our right side let's go to the home and inside the home what we can add uh, or inside the right that right side we forget to add let's check it out yeah home screen we need home screen over here so flex flex home home screen background white and now when we go check it out and it's full at the bottom and that is our right side later here we gonna add our friends and we will be able to search them delete them add them and check their profile so this is it for now for our right side as i said let's see as i said maybe we can add some styling but i think it's good yeah later we might add another styling for the input or something but let's leave it it like this for now and yeah, later we're gonna add friends and we will see what we're gonna do for the styling see you everyone in the next video uh, bye